Hello, hello. Hey, so welcome back, everyone. Uh, s we are about to introduce our second act for this evening. But uh, yeah, there's a few other things that we should probably talk about real quick. Um, we've, we have just unveiled this lovely painting, which uh, we uh, commissioned um, to get done, basically, as one of the things we would do for uh, celebrating our then 15th and now 16th birthday. Um, this painting was done by uh, Josh Baldwin, who you will see in the next two sets. Josh Baldwin, everybody. <laughs> Josh, as you will hear, is an amazing drummer, uh, but his other part of his life is uh, being an amazing painter. So we're uh, so glad that, yeah, uh, we went, yeah, we went across genres with our, uh, with our arts this time around. And I'm being, having my photo taken right now by Emma, and uh, you can clap her. Uh, she often provides uh, photos, excellent, excellent photos of, of the shows and things like that. Uh, and in fact, this is a painting based on one of her uh, photos. And also it's worth pointing out in this, um, we have Maeve there playing trombone. Maeve is doing a lot of the heavy lifting over the, over the uh, desk. Um, and also I'd like to point out on, uh, that's, that's Jamie, a lot of you know Jamie, he's now back in America. But uh, that's Liz playing alto. Now Liz is uh, very much a behind the, that behind the scenes person, but she does so much to make Coma happen. So uh, wherever Liz is, here's to Liz Charlton. Thanks Liz. Hey. <laughs> if she's watching somewhere. All right, cool. Uh, so I think we're gonna move on to our next act. Uh, if you go right back to the first gig that we have advertised, as we said, there's all of the gig posters that we've ever had. Uh, on the very first gig uh, in 2005, we had a version of this group playing, uh, which was, uh, that was, it was listed as Marmalade Trio, I believe, yes. Uh, many of you will know Mark Ferguson's Marmalade franchise, that he's, uh, <laughs> uh, that is, goes all the way out, goes out to orchestra or orchestra or, yeah. Um, but th that actually was a, a trio gig, and I think Shireen was on that as well. Yes. Um, but we didn't have Ben on that, that one. But um, Anyway, do you want to say anything straight up the top? Okay, well then, what's going to happen is I'm going to direct you to clap wildly, and then they will start playing. So, Marmalade Trio, everybody. <laughs>
Thank you very much. Ben Todd on the drums. And on the bass, Shireen Kim Larning. That's a tune of mine called um, Back to Happy Land. Sorry, I'm pressing buttons and trying to talk at the same time. You can't do that. Um, uh, thank you very much. It's an honour to be asked to, to do this gig for the third time it happened. I mean, it happened. Thank you, Th Sam. I'm glad it happened. It's good. I mean, even though you just felt like cancelling it last time, it's great that you didn't get cancelled this time. Um, we're going to continue with a piece um, of mine called Sketchy Elevator. This was a part of a, a, sh a children's show I wrote for the ASO um, based on a book called Herman and Rosie. Um, and this is a little song I, I wrote in the middle of it um, where Rosie, who's a deer who sings jazz, because that's, of course, how it is. Herman is actually an alligator who plays the oboe, jazz oboe. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's why I get so many gigs. Um, um, but Rosie says she's, you know, she's she's going through a dark period in her life, and so this is that moment when she's she's waiting at a sketchy elevator. You know, when you in New York or some of those older cities that have got really old elevators, and they're you don't really want to go in them because they're just sketchy. Um, so anyway, that's what this piece, and we've done a little bit of mucking around with this version of it. So sketchy elevator. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. That's as close to Neo Soul as I ever get. No disrespect to Neo Soul, of course. Um, uh, the next tune we're going to play is a little gospel number. Um, this one's called Now and Forever. First time I played this, I played this in church, and 
little gospel thing, and I played it during the, the collection time. You know, I thought that's a good time for it, and everybody just went, what? It was a little bit too aggressive. <laughs> Wasn't what they were expecting. I was like, oh, what did you play during that? I mean, they, they all enjoyed it, but it was just like, <laughs> okay, so you know now, all right? <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. 
Ben Todd on the drums. Shireen Kemlani on the electric bass. Yeah. I went to drink the microphone. <laughs> I have skills. Um, thank you. It's, look, it's, a, it's a, such a privilege to play um, here. It's such a privilege to play live music, let's be honest. Um, and such a privilege to play in this beautiful venue. Um, um, just so great that there's venues out there that actually support music still. And this is one of the, the best we have. So give another round of applause to the Wheat Chief. And of course, a round of applause to Marty Jones on sound. <laughs> we just got one more tune for you. We thought we'd just give four. I don't know how long we're going, but sorry, hopefully it's not too long. Um, this is a tune I wrote um, some years ago. Um, probably played it at the very first Coma gig. It's a chance. It's probably about that era. I tried to find set list, but it was before I used a computer. Yes, I didn't start using a computer until I was quite old. <laughs> Um, and um, this was a tune I used to play with the Latino um, people and um, we used to play, Shireen and I used to play in this band with Hugo Salcedo, he's a great Colombian um, conga player and entrepreneur and uh, we would play it and he says, that tune is called Descarga Wayala. He always called it that. So this is Descarga Wayala because I was born in Wayala. <laughs> uh, it's definitely a Latino town, as you can tell. It's everything about it just <laughs> screams Latino language and it just it's the vibe. Um, <laughs> Descarga.
Sharin Kimlani on the electric bass. Ben Todd on the drums. Thank you. Mark Ferguson on the keys. Mark Ferguson, everybody. And the Marmalade Trio. All right, we are going to do... what We have two more acts for you this evening. It's a bumper episode for our 16th, so uh, we'll reset slightly for Pocket String Quartet, uh, but we'll be back in five minutes. We'll see you real soon.